Savannah, Georgia, a charming southern escape where art, period architecture, trendy boutiques, and ghost stories all exist. Savannah is a place where cuisine comes straight from the coast and cocktails are served at every meal. Here are 10 things to do in Savannah. Tour the Wilkes House A place to fill your senses with all the tradition of fine southern cooking. The Wilkes House has been feeding southerners for decades now. You can chow down on the same fried chicken, sweet potatoes, okra, gumbo, cornbread, biscuits, and more than that show up on the menu regularly. The menu changes every day, and the atmosphere is decidedly down homey and casual. Seating is family style, everyone pays a flat price to dine, and cash is the only kind of currency accepted here. Try Coastal Empire Beer. Opening in 2011, Coastal Empire Beer Co has quickly been taking awards and taking names as it becomes a favorite among Savannah locals. You can also head over to the tap room for 16 different options on tap and seating. One of the most popular beers they brew up is the Savannah Brown Ale. Take the Here's Ghost Tours If a regular trolley tour isn't really your style, maybe a ghost tour will be more up your alley. That's right! This ghost tour begins by picking you and your travel companions up in your hotel in a real hearse that was used for real funerals for more than 15 years. You'll see much of the city's history, but also hear about its darker side as you take it all in. It's definitely not your average outing. Cool down at Leopold's no matter your age, a great way to end a day in Savannah is with a stop at Leopold's. This little ice cream shop has stayed the same since 1919, when it was opened by Hollywood producer Stratton Leopold. There's always a line, but it'll be well worth it. Stroll around the ships of the Sea Maritime Museum. See all kinds of memorabilia revolving around the ships of the 1700s and 1800s. The home where the museum is housed, it was once the home of the same man who owned the very first steamship to successfully cross the Atlantic Ocean. Even if you're not up for all that boat stuff, the museum is also unique in that it has one of the largest gardens in Savannah's historic district. Have a unique experience at the Old Pink House restaurant. Combine romance and ghosts? That's exactly what the Old Pink House does. The beautiful setting is super elegant with chandeliers, 18th century architecture, and a lovely dining room fireplace. The cuisine is southern but elevated, so you don't have to worry about too much butter popping the buttons on your dress. Have a day with the kids at the University of Georgia Aquarium. This marine education center and aquarium is located on Skidaway Island, near downtown Savannah. There are lots of exhibits on the marine animals that live nearest the state, but there are also lots of other exhibits that show off interesting things, and not even always marine animals. There are also exhibits on things like woolly mammoths and mastodons, as both of the ancient creatures once upon a time lived within the area. Explore the Savannah Waterfront People are sometimes surprised to hear that Savannah has its own river. River Street was historically significant as a warehouse row, highly supporting the cotton industry. But today, guests can walk the cobblestone streets and see centuries of history laid out before them. As they walk past the dozens of businesses within the previously abandoned warehouses right on the river. Whether you're looking for shopping, dining, drinks, or galleries, it's all here. Watch a film at the historic Savannah Theater. The oldest continually operating theater in the United States, the historic Savannah Theater was built in 1818, opening in December with a comedy. Now, the square where it sits has become a huge part of Savannah nightlife and entertainment, mostly because of the theater. Now, while the theater does offer nightly shows, it also offers something else for cinema geeks. Right outside sits a bench where several scenes of the movie Forrest Gump was shot. This is a hugely popular spot for photos. Discover the Tell Fair Museum of Art The oldest art museum in the South. The Tell Fair Museum is housed inside a classical Regency mansion. When you visit, you'll see carefully restored interior rooms, paintings from German Impressionists, and American French, period furniture, silver, and other items. Additionally, the museum houses the largest public collection of paintings by Khalil Gibran. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this about your favorite cities around the world. Let us know in the comments which of the places from our list today you would like to visit the most.